Okay, I'm gonna try to do this <clears throat> in one take. Okay, so we have the GM 1200 Motorola. Okay, this is a battery pack, 16 volts, 14 volts, however it be. This is the negative. Okay, my trick is to hook it onto the chassis, right? That way you always know it's ground. And if you hook it up backwards, uh, well, you can't really. Because you always know this is ground. If you switch these around, it could burn out inside. But you know this is negative. Okay, we're going to turn on. Okay. So I have my box here. I ordered this on uh, <coughs> AliExpress. It was like 20 euros. Saves me the trouble of putting something together. So you push this button here. It's got a nine volt battery inside and you see the power is on. Now let me show you. This is a USB to serial adapter, Lodge Eye Link, and that seems to work okay. Okay, so this is Linux. This is what I prefer. And there's a trick here. We're gonna use VirtualBox. Okay, so I assume you know what you're doing, but this is the trick. You have to give user permissions to the USB device, which we found the serial USB port. Okay, cool. This is configured. Um, I believe we're going to be using Windows 98 today. Windows 95, I'm sorry. Let's see here. Serial ports. Okay. It's saved, it's a saved session, so I can't change this. But you're gonna use host device, right? You're gonna use the real serial port, okay? You're going to put TTY USB zero, right? The device file, which is what we found here. After giving it user permissions. Now I've already got it working. So we're gonna start here, it's all ready. Okay. So, to be in the interest of being helpful, this is Windows 95, remember? This is the software I'm using. Okay. Now, read radio. I'm going to click this button. It's reading from the radio. You see the lights blinking. Seems like a reset. Successfully completed. Okay, now I haven't figured this out completely. But what I can tell you is you probably want to go here, to go here, right? Conventional personality data. The other stuff, this is for an old trunked system, this radio. <clears throat> These radios were used in police cars, right? Police Central or whoever, Taxi Central, probably police. So they're real good radios, right? But what you're gonna do is receive, transmit. You should be the PL tone. You should be able to understand that, right? If you're this far in the video. And uh, you can't make this bigger. You can, but you can't. And then you hit edit, right? Go through the files, PL tone, PL lock, you know, to have the squelch on. <coughs> TX power, your deviation. Set it to this. This is my recommendation. Okay, I don't know what this does, but that should be it. And uh, if you want to do the right, it should program up. 
just fine. Okay.